Okay, I say we start from the beginning again. Actually, I say we save because we just got the item. The first item, not the only item in the dungeon. There's two in here. I think there are two in all of them. Level 3 has two, but they all are for one purpose. That's where we get the bow and arrow. I'm going to try to sing the music of the dungeon, but that would be kind of awkward and weird. The white spikes hurt. I'm sorry that there still isn't too much to say around here. Just a bunch of... So this is a bunch of... Enemies of... There isn't enough cultural diversity, all these enemies are red. There we have another key. So now we're going to head this way. Through the room of... The three rooms of redness. She could use the boomerang, but I don't want to, because I like the hook shot. Using it. What's better than that? The being in making and making you permanently invincible, but it doesn't do that. Oh no, a pile of random debris. Let's go this way. And then this way. For no apparent reason. And there's blocks. And dude's in the way. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Don't make me use force. Don't make me use the force either. That would be bad for you. Here we go. We're going to be getting a heart piece extremely soon. We're going to be getting a heart container extremely soon, too. And then we're going to be getting another heart piece after that. Now here we are in the room of red, red tectites. The hall of the red tectites. And the maze, too. It's amazing that there's so many. So much red. Oh good, blue. Now is there going to be a room full of blue tectites or am I just being cynical? <laughs> I just being cynical. That is what I thought I could bomb. But it's actually the soldering slab. It's the tile. Or the ladder, sorry. And this is down here. Which I don't know if I've been to this room before, so let's elaborate. This is down here. Now that we have the tile, we can cross that single gap. And we can go down here. Oh, actually, we're going to get one more art piece than I thought. So I think we'll have a container of it. Yeah, we'll have a container, a new container before we fight the boss. Thundercracker. If you can't tell it's a cloud, you're probably not thinking too hard.
So we are about to get the first free sword of the game. There are at least two. That I know of. Wait for the boss key? I am. So we go right this way. Kick some butt. Still not done in the basement, though. Sadly, we have not completed the basement yet. Just because we bombed that. And we are done with this floor. This boss door, the boss room, has another three rooms after it that require keys. I'm going to head back there the fast way. I know you're probably wondering where the heck the boss door would even be. But you'll find out soon enough once I do this. No, not that part. That's just a... For that. And now I'm actually going to demonstrate what that extra set of stairs goes. I didn't ever think I would be. See, up here. Then we go up here. And we're out here. Mm-hmm. We're almost done with this level. We'll go up here. Then we get a key. And now we're going to head for the boss. Which may sound odd, seeing as we only have two of the three keys that I mentioned. But you'll find out where key three is soon enough. Also, we'll find a new heart piece soon enough, too. If we don't get stuck on stuff. Over here is a spot. Right there. Key number three. And I found a rupee, so as soon as we leave, I'm going to go get the wallet. Next piece is down here. It's the one I didn't remember earlier. No, it doesn't hurt me. I'm trying to get to the boss without more damage. Okay, well now we're almost there. See, one, two, three, boss. I do not know why he wants salt. Sodium isn't good for you. What a wonderful idea. Let's go over here. 